Hello everyone and welcome back to our Floris mod campaign. I just lost, right before this recording, I lost Jelbeki Castle to the Kurji Khanate. So, I'm going to double my efforts here and try to wipe out the Rodox as fast as I can. So we're going to head up to Jalkala and then I will have to... Ooh, minus. I will have to go back and retake all these castles um, after we're done with the Rodox. All right, Heron Goth, I'm sure I will be there shortly. All right, so there's 512 troops here, but I'm still going to siege. Veluka has been besieged by the the what? The Kirjits are that deep? They haven't been stopped? What in the what? Seems odd to me. I guess the AI just automatically goes for like the weakest places, so they just. Well, like I said, go for the weakest places, but Veluka is not well defended. Hmm. Okay. Well, hopefully we'll deal with that here in a little bit. Situate yourselves. There we go. So this is probably going to be one of those longer ones where we lay siege to them for a little bit, since they outnumber us so much. I don't really feel confident in sending our infantry to uh, fight them. Let's see, Cav. Back up just a little bit. And we are already getting a lot of kills here, which is awesome. Yeah, look at that guy, he just got pelted. And we have to cross a little stream here. Alright. Oh. Whoa, whoa. Whoa. Alright. I got the hints. I'm backing up. Alright, we already have them summoning more enemies. Looks like all of the archers have shots on somebody, so I won't move them. Man, we are doing really good. <laughs> I think we've only lost like four people and they've all been knocked unconscious. This is awesome. So it looks like the enemy... Well, I was going to say the enemy is concentrated over here, but... Eh, I don't know, they're kind of evenly spread out. Although the targets over here may be easier to fire at. But all my archers are... S well, not all of them. Okay, let's have them move down just a little bit. I think that's moving down. 
Okay, never mind. Ooh, they are running out of ammo. Okay. Well, it looks like we're going to have to withdraw and come back. Hmm. Why do I just charge in? I don't know. Even with all those kills, I think we're, they may even still out outnumber us. I think we fall back. Two killed and 20 wounded. We got only 156, so yeah, they still outnumber us. Okay. I think it should still be the same people. Looks good to me. Wait yourselves. You know the drill. Oh, jeez, come on. Hey. Don't be mad. There we go. <laughs> Look at all those kills. And what's crazy is that they're still on numbers. And that wall is stacked with soldiers. Look at all those dots in the mini-map. That will soon change. Hopefully. Let's get the cav up. Maybe get a little easier shots with their arrows. Those that can fire, anyway. Oh, no! No, we've lost two to their 200. Hey, I feel every single kill in our army. That was time I spent leveling that person up. That was money. That was food. Not to mention, I'm sure they have a family somewhere. But I'm not really thinking about that. Wow, <laughs> how quickly those numbers thin on those walls. But yet they still have so many more. I wonder. Oh, he's dead. Never mind. Alright. And... No way. That actually looked like it, it cleared the wall. Right? Maybe not. Ah, oh, it's so hard to see these darts. I, I think that's clearing the wall. But that's not. Oh, it's just like almost there. And now I'm out. <laughs> ah. Yes, get them, my heroes. Yes. What? Oh, I still haven't given Marnid the. Oh well. Everyone's still firing. Let's move up the archers a little bit. Uh-oh. 
Arsh is just starting to run out of ammo. Yep. Jeez. I I think they. S well, maybe they don't outnumber us now, but they. It's still. Hmm. I still don't think we're ready to charge. I think we'll just get slaughtered. Let's do it one more time. I know there's some people that don't like this this tactic, but I don't care right now. <laughs> I'm just gonna be honest. All these troops cost money. I'm gonna lose as few as possible. It's not the most exciting attack method, but it works. was a foggy day. Alright, now we get to try our darts again. back. There we go. They're too close to our other troops here. Alright, infantry advance. Cavalry advance. There we go. Alright, now archers advance a little bit. Pull back a little bit, see if our archers in the cav can fire. Maybe not. How about if I spread you guys out a little bit? There we go. That's better. Definitely not getting as many kills, I'm assuming because of the fog? Hmm. Not good. Let's bring our archers up closer then. We need more of those Rodox killed. Here we go. Alright, let's also have them stand a little bit closer. Let's see if they can just form up some ranks here. Come on, archers. Clear the way for us. Wow, they actually hit me. One of the crossbowmen, you darts. Ah! Our archers are getting like no kills. Okay, let's try this. Let's get our archers even closer. Okay. Okay. That's a little better. Move 
move up the heroes. Wow, they're already out of arrows or oh man. Hmm, they did not do as much work as I was hoping. Let's scoot them down to where all the other people are still firing so they have better shots. Alright, let's give this a try. Charge my soldiers! Charge until you can't charge no more! Oh, this is chaotic. And I'm somehow getting shot, even though I'm buried in bodies here. Get me over to those archers! Oh no, another fight at the stairs. Oh god. No! There's gotta be a better way! Those crossbowmen are just getting free hits! I cannot move! Oh my god! Uh, they are still hitting you in the back! Oh well, at least the infantry's almost done, so they'll finally switch their attention to these guys. Oh yeah, yeah. I still like to know how the heck I was getting hit when I'm buried in all these bodies, but oh well. I could kill by their Brodoc militia or crosswoman in melee. Come on. Thank goodness. Imagine if we had assaulted them with our melee forces without weakening them with archers. Yeah, that would have been bad. Okay, let's get some replacements. Grab some manhunters. Grab you. Yeah, sure. Okay, and captives. So, now I need to worry about the Khajiits. 
Because they are raiding uh, the Luka. I will... Alucard has no... Oh, because they're taking their castles. Let's give it to Aldegar. Oh, I still need to talk to <laughs> Johanna. Whoops. Been a bit busy lately. Oh, Veluca's no longer under siege. Okay. Which means I may be able to just pop on over here to this castle. Where all of their lords are stationed. <laughs> Oh, that's a lot of people. That is a lot of people. Do I, do I do that? Well, since that's their last castle, you know what? I I will fight it out, but it's probably going to be another one of those where we have to attack them and then withdraw once and then attack them again. Because I, I can't afford to lose anybody. Because I need to stop these Khajiits. They have three castles already. And even after I take this Rodok castle, the Rodok lords are probably still going to be running around trying to take my, my stuff back. Which is going to be annoying. But, yeah. So I think I'll do that in the next episode, everybody. So I'll do that, and then see if I can come back over here and take out the Khajiits. Then after that... I don't want to fight the Serenids yet, so we're just going to focus on the Nords again. I probably... I don't really want to go up here, because then that may have the Serenus want to attack us more. So I think I may just go up this coast. We'll go for Sargoth and all the surrounding castles first. Hmm. Yes. Still so much more to conquer. Jeez. But look at us. We're pretty big. <laughs> it's pretty cool. Alright, so that's going to do it for this episode, everybody. So hope you enjoyed. I will see you all next time. Take care.